I came into the Caldwell program as an undergrad student. Uh, I got my teaching certification there. And then uh, one day I was on campus, I met Dr. Reeve and she talked to me a little bit about the ABA program. And what she mentioned is that uh, currently we have, you know, few students, but that's something I should look at because I was looking to further my career uh, in that field. I think I chose Caldwell uh, only because I think, uh, firstly, it was very, very recommended to me by people who were in the program already and who I have worked closely with uh, and who were in the doctoral program. And secondly, I met with Dr. Seidner because I was working and I was, uh, you know, working full time and I'm a mom. She actually allowed me to do practicum that fits into my schedule. So she worked with me, you know, so that I could uh, do practicum during the summer in the evening. So for me, I think that was kind of like a clincher that they are ready to, you know, faculty was ready to work with me. My favorite part of the program, it was practicum because I really got to work with students and different faculty members. Um, so that was really cool to see. And the first uh, semester I got to work with Dr. Dibar and uh, she really, really encouraged me to speak up and, uh, you know, answer questions in the classroom, which I wasn't used to as a working individual. So that's something that, you know, I have all these favorite memories that uh, I had, you know, when I was in the master's program. Uh, and then when I started working on my thesis, that's when I really decided to go for the doctoral program because I really enjoyed the process of uh, what I wanted to do as thesis and how to go about it. So almost, you know, combining into a task analysis and working with Dr. Seidner. So that really got me excited. I do think that I'm going to continue with my clinical position because I absolutely adore working with the kids, getting to know the parents. Uh, and also hoping to teach, you know, some of those really cool courses that faculty teach, like language and social skills, especially maybe analysis of verbal behavior. Or the other thing is just being able to always keep in touch with faculty and grow and learn.